Hello everyone, this is Matt and welcome to another Tunnel Shot in which I'll be playing through Chemical Plant .wad, or just Chemical .wad with Kun's Awakening. Well, I keep saying Kun Awakening, it's actually Kun Awakening. But okay, so this is gonna be interesting. I don't really know a whole lot about this map, I'm going in blind as usual. No monsters, but okay. okay there's a nymph here. Okay. I think this might showcase Kun's Awakening, Kun Awakening's weapons a little bit better. Because, well, in the last one it was just a pistol and shotgun. And a knife, which I will be using kind of extensively because I got the feeling that the guns here, they don't just don't really have a whole lot of ammo. Okay. So this part is a little tricky, I guess. Yeah, I see what it wants me to do, but yeah. Oh, come on, come on. Almost, almost had it. Oh, I did have it, I did have it, I had it. Yeah, I had it there. Okay, there we go. So shotgun. Wait a second. Let me test something here real quick. Yep. Okay, so this is that mapping design. As you can see, I'm stuck here. Of course, I'm not playing vanilla, so I can just like jump over that. But still. Okay, got a... I think that's a grenade. Yeah, I'm just gonna use three shells on this Hell Knight here. Okay, so what's up this part here? Okay, come on. Okay, I'm gonna stop the you. I'm gonna stop the ping on that hole. We don't need to do that anymore. Okay. So yeah. Yeah, I don't mind this. The knife is pretty powerful. Okay, I think there is another caco somewhere around here. Hey you, come over here. Okay, shells, very good. Come on, come on. Oh, that's 20 damage for. Okay. Doesn't look like it's a secret. Okay, Spectre. So, let's gonna lower this part. Okay. There's some... I think that's ammo for the assault rifle and some health, okay. Okay. Yeah, it's all about being careful, I guess. Yeah. Okay, that was uh, so that was what five shots for the caco. Okay, so not nearly as bad as I thought it was. Okay, hmm. okay, so I wasn't really talking a whole lot about the map design, but. This is like some sort of chemical plant, I guess. So in that other part we were in, you know, bear with me for just a second, but you know. So you have the the, the radioactive, radioactive slime there. Oh, forgot the armor shards there. So probably good idea that I, it's probably good that I actually came back here. And oh, we have some more here. Okay, and what's that? 
I have no idea. Okay. Um, we're gonna find out in just a second. Okay, so... Marshalls. Marshalls is always good. And, you know, this part here we have... We have a bit of a water channel. What the hell is that noise? Okay. Boy, what is this? Oh. So is your replacement. Okay, that sounded a little weird, but pretty good. No. Oh, yeah. This one isn't looking at me. Okay. Okay, there are some Hell Knights there. Fallen shells. I should probably take care of at least one of them. Okay. Okay. Back off just a bit. Yeah, those bars look like they are wide enough for me to just like run through them. Okay, so that was those, well, that was the, the pair of Hell Knights over there, and just to make sure I can actually do it. Okay. Okay. Oh, there's the assault rifle. Okay, so I can progress, and yes, I should go back to the other part over there. Gonna get, gonna get that, those, yeah, that shell box. And gonna find out just what that weird noise is. Okay, so we have two cacos. Yeah, no rush. Oh, that's actually really interesting. So. I switched weapons while the shotgun was still pumping, and I... Oh! Is this the Super Shotgun replacement? It is! I'm pretty sure that's the Super Shotgun because the SR Rifle is in another part. Okay, so that's the thing that's making a weird noise. Yeah, so as I was saying... So, I think... Okay, I switch weapons before the shotgun was done pumping. Okay, and now if I switch back, it's gonna pump. Okay, that's a really cool touch. I haven't seen that done before. Okay, I guess I'm just supposed to run back over there. Okay. Okay, I've got a box of pistol ammo. Okay. Okay, so that little submachine gun here is actually pretty strong. That's cool. Oh, and those bars are lowered now. Okay, very cool. Uh, wish I would have the assault rifle though. Doesn't look like this has a lot of ammo for it. Okay, okay, what do we have here? Okay. Yeah, I'm just thinking. Okay. Yeah, I like this part. I'm liking this map a lot so far. It's certainly a little bit challenging, but... Well, I don't think it's too challenging, at least not yet. Okay, so, just gotta run across, okay, oh, okay, that was a little bit, yeah, I think that, that, that I think I'm going back for that, I guess it's a soul sphere, soul sphere, no, mega sphere, yeah, I'm going back for that. <laughs> But yeah, um, I'm liking this a lot so far.
I'm almost done with the map, with the map, Joe. Okay. I probably wouldn't, didn't really need that. But sure. So, what are you? Chimera Heart. Okay. And it does just what the Megasphere does. Okay. Very unusual. Eh, makes perfect sense. No need to fix what isn't broken. So, I just went straight across here. Okay. Oh, there is another Archwell. Okay. Yeah. And Blood Trail. Can interact, so. Oh. Okay. So, secret that's not tagged as a secret. Got it. Okay. this assault rifle so far. It's powerful. Yeah, it sounds pretty powerful. Okay, there's nothing there. Armor that I don't really need. Okay, so this is a really interesting way of balancing things. Because, you know, in Doom, it's common that you... Well, that you get at least a super shotgun or a double row shotgun or something like a shotgun that's better. Like, it uses more ammo, but, you know, it does more damage. Okay. Uh, in here? No. Here it's... Oh, I almost fell there. Yeah, I don't think there is a way to get back up there. Okay, um... Okay, grenade, we have one. No. And we have one, forget it. Can I get out of here? Okay, I can. Yeah, so that's kind of, so as usual, bad map design. If you're going to put the player here, either put some bars around here that keeps the player from falling in, or add some form of, add a lift really, just make like this section here a little, make this like a raised section or fuel it up. I don't know, There's a, there are many ways of handling that. Oh, and no, there are better ways of handling that than just like making a pit that the player can escape from. Yeah, that sort of stuff just isn't really that rewarding, I think. Okay. Round down. Okay. Oh yeah, I didn't even use this thing. I think it's the plasma rifle replacement. And there is a whole lot of nothing here. Yeah, I could have com I completely forgot about it. I could have used the... I could have used this. I used the assault rifle instead. Which does feel very good, as Particle Providence said. Just one, one regular zombie. But this isn't like a lightning gun. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get another map to test this one out, because it does look really fancy. So... Got the we got the shotgun. This what's this? Yeah, the machine pistol, the rifle. No, I didn't get a rocket launcher, and I didn't get the BFG here either, or the chainsaw. Just a knife. Yeah. Okay, so I think there's no point in delaying this. Yeah. I thought that was actually the exit, or not the exit itself, but hey, whatever, it works, I'm not complaining. So, as usual, seems no, this is just a single map, there's nothing after it, so as usual, I'm just gonna cap it off here. So, um, well, give Cabin Cold a lot of try if you like, it seems like a pretty good map. A little bit challenging too, there are like two arch miles there. Didn't really see that one coming, but it was, thankfully, very manageable. But okay, 
So, as usual, if you like what you saw, consider liking, commenting, subscribing, all the good stuff. And that's it, really. So, this has been Matt, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.